And Meghalaya is a very beautiful state. The capital of Meghalaya, Shillong, is also a very nice place. Because now I visited the Northeastern Hill University. And that university is also on the hill. <laughs> and therefore, I am very happy there is a my good field. In my mind there is a good field because your university is on the hill. <laughs> the teacher sees our teacher. Teacher sees our feature and teacher is our nature. <laughs> Without teacher, there is no education. If there is no education, there is no good nation. <laughs> if you want the good nation, then there should be the good education. And without teacher, there is no education. If the teacher will not go in the school, then how the student will teach? And therefore, there are many problems. Today, our chief minister, Today's chief guest, Conrad Kongal Sangma, the chief minister of Meghalaya. And his father was a very great leader. His father was the speaker of Lok Sabha. His father was the minister in government of India. And I respect late Sangmaji. And today the Sangma Sainis became the chief minister of Meghalaya. I visited the Tura also. And Sangma's family is also related from Tura. Because of Sangma's place is Pura. Therefore, Conrad Kongal Sangma is our hero. <laughs> he is my good friend. And today, he has given the assurance to you. Because all the teachers are also present here. And our Kenneth shut up. In Meghalaya, the names are very hard. <laughs> and, you, and your names are very hard, therefore, problems are very hard. <laughs> Kenneth shut up is also a very strong leader. He knows the problem of the teacher. And in your state, you have given me the memorandum that 1,857 schools are there. And only 7,082 teachers are there in all over the state. This strength is also very low strength. And definitely, today all the teachers came here because the government has given the holiday to all the schools. <laughs> and all the teachers also came here. If there was no holiday, then all the teachers can't come here. But for our problem, you are shown your saying today in front of the chief minister, in front of 
me as a social justice and empowerment state minister in Narendra Modi's government. And Narendra Modi told us that all the ministers should go to the northeastern states. And we want to develop, we want to more help from our mantralaya to every state. And therefore, Mr. <coughs> Kenneth, now his uh, Kenneth is in Meghalaya. <laughs> Kenneth is in Meghalaya, but Kennedy is America. <laughs> Is the, there is a similarity of the name, only Kennedy and Kennedy. <laughs> then he knows your problem, and therefore he call all of you. And uh, your demand is to increase the teachers, lecturers in secondary school, school, higher secondary school, and definitely from the government of India, from the HRD ministry, <coughs> definitely myself I will try, because Ramesh Pokhriwal, Nishang, he was the chief minister of Uttarakhand, and now he is the, became the HRD minister in Narendra Modi's government. Definitely I will discuss with him. And this your problem is also a very important problem because schools are 1,857 and teachers are only 7,082. Then I asked to shut up. His name is shut up. <laughs> His name is Sharab, but many times people are talking Sharab. <laughs> <laughs> then he gave me the memorandum. And uh, we want to increase the teacher because without the teacher, how can you teach the people? You know that Dr. B. R. Ambedkar was a very great teacher. Always he was the teacher. Always he was uh, reading the books and writing the books. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar was the professor in Mumbai in Sydney College. And he was a good professor. And all the teachers from all the schools and Secondary schools, this your problem is also a very important problem. And definitely, Honorable Sangma, the Chief Minister of Meghalaya, he also gives the assurance he will arrange one meeting and how the problem will be solved. That is not only the responsibility of the Meghalaya government. Because Sangmaji said that 85% revenue is coming from Narendra Modi's government, from central government. And Narendra Modi is also a very strong leader. Narendra Modi is also a very strong prime minister. Because you know that the 370, that there were Many peoples were anti. In Jammu Kashmir, many peoples were anti. But Narendra Modi and Amit Shah take the decision to finish the 370. <laughs> many peoples were opposing, but not the citizens of the Jammu Kashmir. But some peoples, those who are opposing India, those Atangwadi supporting to the Pakistan, how they can support the Pakistan? 
If you are staying in Kashmir, Jammu, then how can you support the Pakistan? If you are going to support the Pakistan, you go Pakistan. <laughs> you don't disturb the Jammu and Kashmir people. We don't want violence in the Jammu Kashmir. And you have seen that last 15, 20 days. There is no violence. All the Jammu Kashmir is quiet. Because army is there. Nobody is coming out. If Atangwadi will come in out, then he will be out. <laughs> and therefore now Jammu Kashmir is also very quiet. And we are not going to oppose the people of the Jammu Kashmir. We want to develop the Jammu Kashmir. And uh, many decisions our government is also taking. And all the people from the Meghalaya, Honorable Chief Minister, Sangma's party is also supporting the Narendra Modi, NDA. My party, Republican Party of India, is also supporting the Narendra Modi. Because there is no other alternative. I can't support Rahul Gandhi. Because today, the strength of the Congress party is not strong. How can I support the Congress party? And therefore, Narendra Modi is also a very good leader. He is also supporting the Hindu people, Muslim people, Christian people, Buddhist people. Narendra Modi is also Sabka Saat, Sabka Vikas, Sabka Viswas. That is the slogan of the Narendra Modi. And therefore, this is also the good opportunity to take more funds from the government of India to the Meghalaya. And this is your problem. Definitely 5,000 or something teachers will be increased. Then some, our youth will be take benefit of the employment. And if we want to run the school systematically, then we want to increase the strength of the teachers. And we want to increase the strength of the students also. Everybody should go in the school. And this atmosphere is also a very good atmosphere. And uh, today, you take the umbre umbrella for rain. But there is no rain. <laughs> there is a good heat. Therefore, this umbrella you are using for heat. All right. And in this stadium, the, all the teachers are also present here. And our uh, Mr. Dominic Thapa, then Dining Roy Marvin, Jane Tia, traditional uh, Dance will be there now. And our president of EMRI, EM Royper Raswai. And one whom massage. And our uh, RPI the leader, Vinod Nikalji. Assam president of Republican Party, Itesh Deuri. And all the delegates are also present here. And I'm not going to take your more time because I came so late. Because my flight was late. Therefore, I came here one and a half hour, two hours late here. But all the teachers are also present here. You want to go to your places. But I, uh, I am also very happy to give the assurance that definitely from the government of India, the more fund will be released for this, your educational problem. And definitely, <laughs> definitely our government is also very, 
interesting to support to the Meghalaya teacher. And if the teacher strength will be increased, then employment will be great here, and the schools will be very strengthened. And therefore, I assure <coughs> Kennedy, you don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry, we are worrying how to help you. <laughs> but we are not worrying because uh, our government is also very strong. Our economy is also very strong. And now the Reserve Bank of India announced to give the one lakh seventy six thousand rupees to the government of India. Therefore, there is no problem of the money. <laughs> and definitely, I will discuss, I will wrote the letter to the Prime Minister also. I will go and meet Mr. Ramesh Pukriyal, the HRD Minister. And he is also my good friend. Definitely, today, our uh, Kenneth organized this very nice program here, and the stadium is also full. And uh, if your strength is also very good strength, then definitely, Government of India will be given the good money. <laughs> Therefore, I am not going to take your more time, but I am very happy to see this your strength. And from my mantralaya, my mantralaya is having the scheduled cast, DNT, OBC, and now the government of India has given the 10% reservation to high caste community. Those people, those castes are not included in SC, ST, and OBC. The government of India has given the decision, Parliament has passed the law to give the 10% reservation to those families whose families' income is under 8 lakh rupees in education and in government services. And therefore, the reservation is for all now. This reservation is for Hindu, Muslim, Christian, Buddhist, all, all. Therefore, they, our government has taken many decisions, but today I am very happy to give the assurance that uh, definitely government of India, government of India will be with you, yeah. and uh, definitely some problem should be finalized from our chief minister, honourable chief minister Sangmaji and some problems will be solved from the government of India and definitely the government of India and state government will be with you and therefore I am not going to take over more time but you, Kennedy, you invited me but Kenneth invited me here but Kennedy was not invited me in America <laughs> <laughs> alright but uh, therefore uh, thank you very much Jai Bhim, Jai Bharat, Jai Meghalaya. <laughs>